is up yo guys and welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl mimia oh, yeah. Hi. <laughs> sorry sorry hindi pala ako yun so what is up everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl cat p and if you're new here haven't seen this effing face then i would suggest to click the subscribe button below and hit the notification bell to notification bell hit the notification bell to stick around so as you all know in the title that we are going to be doing some cream puff baking today and um a lot of you guys requested that i should be doing my videos in the kitchen na lang kasi hindi naman talaga ako professional sa mga uh, makeup 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 na yan <laughs> grabe ang harsh ko na sa sarili ko but anyways so without further ado, so we're gonna start the We're here now in the kitchen, and I'm going to weigh my bread flour. If you want, you can also use all-purpose flour, but I really prefer bread flour for this recipe. So after I weigh my flour. I'm gonna weigh my butter and also I crack some couple of eggs and then some water and water goes in and then we're going to um, put this to a boil a really hot boiling water and butter let's make sure that it's really really Hot before we we can add the the next ingredient. So now that we are sure that it is really boiling hot, we can now add our bread flour. So the bread flour goes in and now we have to stir it um, very very fast because we don't want our bread flour to be burnt and in this way we, we are forming our dough, our dough for our shoe paste. So now that our dough is formed we can now transfer it into a mixer but if you have your hand mixer you can also use that or you can also mix it by hand because it's pretty easy but I'm I'm kind of lazy today so <laughs> so I'm just going to use this and I turn it on because I want it to cool down a little bit because we're going to add our eggs later and we don't want to have scrambled eggs in our mixture we want it to be nice and all incorporated so now we are going to add our first egg Oop. okay and then let it mix again until nice and incorporated So now we are ready to put our last ingredient which is our last egg also. Just dump it all in and put the mixer on speed and wait until everything is nice and blended. This recipe is pretty easy right and also a few ingredients so you can really try this at home if you want. <laughs> Now that everything is nice and blended, we can now transfer our um, mixture into our piping bag. If you want, you can also have some glass and put the piping bag into the glass while you put your mixture. 
and I also prepared my baking tray which I covered in butter and then dusted off with flour because I find it best not to put flour in the tray because it's not sticking while I pipe the the shoe paste so but it kind of works as well too I just struggle a little bit but <laughs> It's up to you. What do you prefer? Let me know if you prefer coating it with flour or just leaving it with butter. So yeah, we just want to pipe the rest of our butter into our baking tray and then don't forget to preheat the oven because it won't rise well if our oven isn't preheated. So yeah. ready for our babies to be in the oven and I'll be showing you what it looks like after it's cooled down and fully cooked like this all right so let's see now we have a lot of air pockets inside our profiterole so that is a good start Ah, sobrang init. Sobrang init, guys. Galing ako sa oven. Ay, <laughs> galing sa oven. I mean, sa kusina. Init dahil sa oven. Sobrang init na naglalangis na tayo ngayon. And, ito yan. dami kong mga tigyawat dyan. Pero, okay lang yan. Love yourself, girl. And, hindi tayo perfecto. Lahat ng tao tinitigyawat. Kahit si Kim Chu. Pinapabelo niya. Pero, ay ati Kim. So, anyways, guys. Yun na nga. Baka may mambash lang dyan na. Ang dami mong tigyawat. Ang taba, ganyan. Hello, ako po to. And, mahal ko yung sarili ko. Kahit ganito ko. Nagpalit na ako ng sando. Kasi, sobrang magagurigiray ko yung sando ko. Sobrang init. Super happy kasi maganda yung outcome ng cream puffs natin. Tama yung texture, tamang tama yung kinalabasan. Kasi takot ako kanina, baka hindi ko magawa. <laughs> Ayun, kahit na... Ayun, ko ilang bandit na lang na kung hindi nakakabag... Bandit ba o magkataon na? Na hindi nakakabag ng cream puffs. So, ayun. Nagawa ko naman siya ng tama kanina kasi may hole dun sa loob nung... Nung... Pinapay. So, yung bread. So, okay siya. So, next video na gagawin natin is yung feeling ng cream puffs. So, abangan nyo yan, mga girls. Mga girlfriends ko dyan, kung mayroon man. Mm -hmm. Abangan nyo na yan. So, ayun lang. That is it for today's video. And super easy lang, ba Kaya, try nyo na yan sa bahay nyo. So, ipapost ko yung ingredients sa my description box. So, kung nagustuhan nyo itong video na to, like nyo na and subscribe na kay sa channel ko. Please no more. For more, for more kitchen vlogs coming up and syempre, hindi mo wala mga beauty beauty vlogs natin. Tapos, <laughs> gusto ka ng iba dyan. Hello po sa inyo. Sa ton, di ba ako perfect na magaling or beauty girl pero So, tama na nga yan. Tama na yan. Okay. So, see you guys on my next video. Bye!